So this door is basically an insulated uh, fire door. This door has been tested as per the latest IS fire standards. The application of this door is to be used in case of emergency exits or pathways where we are going to have man escapes. Now this is a panic bar which has a latch and in case of emergency by touching it the door will open. If you see on this side we have a frame with an inbuilt ceiling system. This is also fire rated. All the hardware that we provide on the door are completely fire rated and they are tested. If you look on the side, you will find that we have a label which has all the information that a customer or an authority who is visiting will need. We are also the first ones in the country to have an ISI label. If you look at it, it has all the information right from the type of product to the manufacturing date to the serial number of the door. This, this is individual serial number. And we, if you look at the bottom, we also have a QR code. The advantage of this QR code is that through a camera scanner, anyone who scans it gets all the required information. So the advantage of the app is that once you scan it, it gives us all the information. So this, is, this can be used in various uh, ways. One can be at the time of installation to update the customer of the kind of doors and the quantity have been installed. Tomorrow if there is an issue, through this QR code the customer can inform us about the product and what the problem is. And this has, so all this information helps us in giving uh, responses and solutions faster. Because we, we in our factory have the data of all the doors we make. So it helps us troubleshoot the problems very fast. The, this is a glass, this is also fire rated. If you look at it, uh, the it's a 60 mm shutter here and it provides 30 minute insulation and uh, 120 minutes fire rating. And if you look on the top, it's a sliding door closer. The important function of a fire door is to ensure that it's self-closing. So at any point of time, if you release the door, it has to close on its own. On the other side, we have something which is called an external trim. This is basically used for giving access from the other side. So we have two types. One is a controlled access. The other one is an open access. So that is why we've also given an option of a key.